Hey guys, what's up? It's Annie. In today's vlog, I am in Washington, D.C. and I'm having a little Tuesday afternoon fun day. Uh, I got off work early and I'm going to my cousin Chrissy's house. She's preparing like a nice lunch for some of the ladies in my family and then we are going to Lincoln's Cottage and I think that is what I plan to vlog today. Uh, Lincoln the Lincoln that we are referring to is Abraham Lincoln, obviously, and I don't know anything about his cottage. I don't know if it was a place that he went for vacation, for a retreat, for solace. I don't know. We're going to learn about it today, and I figured I would bring you guys along, so let's head there. All right, guys, so we just got here. We actually went through this little checkpoint right here, showed our ID, and now we are in the visitor center. We're about to go in the visitor center. And this is so cute. Masks are required. Even Abe's wearing his mask. And the visitor center is open daily from 9.30 to 4.30. Very cool. The visitor center had a neat little museum, but photography was not allowed. Once our tour started, our tour guide, Rebecca, took us into the cottage. We had 13 people in our group, which seemed like the perfect number. Photography was also not allowed in the house, but we were allowed to take pictures on the back porch, which had beautiful views of the grounds. Each room in the cottage had audio-visual aids that really helped to tell the story. There were also chairs and benches in each room just in case you needed to sit down during the tour. It made the tour much more comfortable. Our tour just ended at the cottage and we had Rebecca as our tour guide. She was awesome. Such an amazing storyteller. You can really tell she loves working here and giving tours. <laughs> and it is raining, but it actually makes this very peaceful. Oh, there's the visitor center right there. And there's where we came in. I wanted to show you guys this sign. MacArthur Drive, Lincoln Drive. Oh, I'm walking in kind of wet grass, but that's okay. That's really pretty with the trees behind it. Hey, Abe. Thanks for having us at your cottage. It's pretty cool. Apparently, our tour guide, Rebecca, told us that he used to keep papers in his hat. That was like his spot. You know, if he had, he always was taking notes and he would just stick them up in his hat. What a great spot. Our tour guide told us such great stories about the cottage. Really, really interesting. If you get a chance to come here, I highly recommend it. Just a lot of history, a lot to learn here. And just simply beautiful, even with a little drizzle. And right next to the cottage is the veteran's home. And the veteran's home actually predated the cottage. It's been a veteran's home before Lincoln ever lived here. And the cool thing is they even have their own visitor parking lot, so you have plenty of parking spaces to choose from. Here we are driving off the property and I was admiring the decor. It was so beautiful. So we just finished up at Lincoln's Cottage. It was awesome, like I cannot recommend it enough. Our tour guide, Rebecca, she had so much knowledge. She was so informative and her tour was even pretty inspirational like I she ended the whole tour kind of posing a question to us and kind of kind of a call to action kind of a call to make change like Lincoln did and uh, just to make the world a better place and I really I loved her energy it was really cool uh, and then we got to walk around the grounds a little and it was just so awesome so thank you to my cousin Chrissy for setting up the tour I really appreciate it and it was just so much fun to hang out with my family but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and and until the next vlog, bye guys.